This is boxing. Nothing ceases to amaze me in this crazy business and game. And welcome, you're watching Aldon's Reviews and Entertainment. So, world and UK fight news. Will Tony Bello make a comeback? Tony Bello, great heavyweight. It wasn't clear in his interview, was it? Have a look at the interview, see what you think. Put down in the comments whether you think he should come back or whether, is he a bit old now? How are you? You look well. I'm all right, thank you very much. Trying. Are you training? Get a bit of weight off. I'm trying to get the trim. What does that mean? That means I'm just trying to get a bit of weight off because I'm a fat bastard. Tell about that. You're not as skinny as Eddie Hearn nowadays, the athlete that is Eddie Hearn. He looks absolutely fantastic, don't he? Good on him. I interviewed David Price a week ago. Did you? And I said to David Price, a little bit of a, a wild card banter question, really. I said, if you fought Tony Bellew, would it sell out the Echo Arena? Which is not the Echo Arena, it's the MS Bank Arena. And he said, absolutely it would, in a second. Yeah. This was last week. Okay. Then he said that he's happily retired, but he said that he thinks that you will definitely fight again. This is what David said. Uh, I don't know. But no, I would never fight him anyway. It's me friend. Not him, but he just thinks in general you will fight again. Also, put down in your comments which boxer, probably heavyweight, has got the biggest punch in the world at the moment. Also, put in the comments who you think who has had and has the biggest punch in the world of boxing heavyweights. Put it down. Would it be crazy if Ngannou was to beat Joshua? No. Why would it be crazy? He's a man with two arms and two legs. He's probably the... Well, I'll tell you right now. He is single-handedly the baddest man on the planet. Because nobody in the whole world is fighting with that man in a dark alley and coming out winning. No one. That guy is probably the strongest fighting machine I've ever witnessed. I witnessed him in a cage. I watched that man throw a punch so hard, he knocked Derek Lewis down with the wind that missed him. He missed and it put Derek Lewis down. And Derek Lewis is a big one, by the way. So, <clears throat> Franz Singani is, 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 is a phenom. He's a, a freak athlete. Uh, in a boxing ring, he, he's, a, he's a total different, total different kind of breed. He's, if I'm being totally honest, the strongest attribute is his mental capacity and his mental strength, not his boxing ability or his boxing skills. So. Let's just see how it goes. Does Joshua have to knock him out? No. Josh could box him all day. Far better boxer, technically far superior. As I said, you've just got to take away his will. You've got to take away his mental strength and his mental capacity. And if you keep making someone miss and picking up on their technical flaws, because he has them, he has many of them. 